Materials, particle board, cut to size, polyfill, the quilting kind, staple gun, and then any choice fabric that you want to cover it at the end. So first you have to measure the distance between each as well as the height that you cannot go past. All right, so here's my staircase. I took the measurements 48 inches this way, 28 inches tall for that first gap. This is the size of what I'm building. So I subtracted one inch to determine my height. And then I added five inches on both sides to get my full length. So that way it just overhangs outside of the staircase and doesn't come out easily. And just in case you didn't know, um, if you ask Home Depot or Lowe's nicely, they will cut it for you. Just give them the measurements. Okay, so next part is you literally just wrap the board in the polyfill and then staple. Next is what I consider the fun part. I'm gonna take the fabric of my choice, by the way, make sure you buy enough to like completely wrap around and a little extra because of the cushion. I made that mistake the first time. Anyways, I am going to add some artwork to it. So once you have, if you choose to paint on it, wait until it completely dries and then we attach it. Almost there. Okay, that's it. There you have it. 